Hey, I just wanted to make a really quick video showing how you could measure your heart rate on your iPhone. Uh, if you're not too much into fitness, maybe you just want to do once in a while heart rate monitoring, maybe before you go to bed, uh, after you wake up, or during or after a workout. Uh, and it's pretty easy and pretty handy to do this on the iPhone. Uh, so I will show you how. Uh, the first thing you need to do is you need to go into the App Store and you need to search for heart rate. There are numerous apps and there are doing heart rate monitoring. I tried several of them, but I haven't found them that good. And uh, so when you get into uh, the App Store and search for heart rate, there will be a lot of apps showing up here. Um, for example, I tried this one from Runtastic. Uh, it didn't work at all. It didn't even get my pulse when I was trying. Um, then I've been trying some free ones uh, that hasn't been working that well either. So the one I found that I think works the best is actually this one. Uh, it's uh, sleep cycle heart rate. So <clears throat> sleep cycle heart rate, uh, you'll purchase, I think it's about $3 or something uh, around there. Um, now I already purchased it, uh, so I don't see the price, uh, but it's also available in the sleep cycle bundle where you get both uh, sleep cycle and uh, sleep cycle power nap and sleep cycle heart rate. And they are all uh, pretty decent apps, I would say, so I can recommend getting all of them uh, for tracking sleep and tracking power naps. Uh, so when you have this app, uh, you just open it. And uh, what you have here is uh, a statistics tab. Uh, you have your settings. Uh, and the settings are, are pretty straightforward. You just have your profile. You have uh, notes that you could uh, enable or disable. Um, the profile info, which is just if you um, enter weight da uh, data, height data, gender, birth date. Uh, and this you could also grab straight from the health kit kit app. Uh, you can also choose to share data with the health kit, uh, which I do because I think it's really handy to get it all collected there in the health kit. Uh, when you want to measure, you click down here in the bottom uh, on measure and uh, then it says place your finger gently over the rear camera lens. You place your finger over the camera and the light that is uh, lighting up your finger to be able to read the pulse, I guess. Uh, and in a few seconds, it will show me that my pulse at the moment is 63 beats per minute. Um, then I can add a note to that and say, okay, when was this uh, recorded? And I would say now that it's uh, more or less during uh, resting, uh, not really before bed. But hey, I just skip it for now because I'm actually doing something. And uh, so I don't put any comment there. And then it will be uh, added with all the data in here. And it will be automatically moved into HealthKit. Uh, so when I go into HealthKit here, uh, I scroll down to heart, uh, heart rate. And uh, out on the right here, the latest heart rate data will be visible from uh, what I took, 63 beats per minute. Uh, I will have some more videos up on uh, how to use the health kit because it's uh, pretty handy. Uh, but uh, this was all we were going to go through for now. Uh, a last tip there is that uh, it, sometimes it's hard to remember to take your pulse uh, on a regular basis. And if you at least want to get some data on your uh, on your pulse over time, uh, I recommend you to use sleep cycle as uh, your wake up clock, because uh, when uh, when you use it as an alarm clock, uh, you can enable a setting uh, that is uh, check heart rate uh, after you wake up. So this is sleep cycle. It will be for another video uh, walkthrough of uh, sleep cycle. Uh, but then you just enable <coughs> heart rate here. And when you have that enabled, uh, the moment you wake up, 
it will light up the light of your phone and you just place your finger on the camera and it will record your pulse and it will save it uh, automatically as wake up pulse. So that's pretty good for, for getting uh, some more uh, regular statistics on it. And that was all for now. If you like this or if you have any questions about it, please don't hesitate to uh, put those questions in the comments below. And if you like the video and want more stuff like this, please subscribe to my channel. Have a nice day.